In this video, I'm gonna show you guys how I do what I call my parking lot portraits. It is basically a studio look, but it's actually shot outdoors using available light. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Let's check it out. Welcome back to The Breakdown. My name is Miguel Quiles. I am here today in New Jersey with the beautiful Anna, and we're gonna be shooting some portraits outdoors here in my parking lot. And this is something that if you like the look of studio shots, but maybe you don't have studio lighting, then it's okay. We can totally fake that look using available light. So today I'm very fortunate. I'm actually here with the new Sony a7R III. And this camera was just recently announced. It is actually a prototype. Um, however, it is still functioning. Everything is working great. I also have the new 24 to 105 F4 G series lens from Sony. And so today, this is what I'm gonna be using for all of these portraits. Now let's talk really quickly and let me break down the setup for you. All right, so let's go ahead and talk about the uh, setup that we're using here. Um, it is an overcast day, which does help us, but what I want to kind of make sure that you guys understand is that the way that this works is that I'm actually here in the shade. So it is overcast everywhere right now in this uh, parking lot is shade. When we started shooting, it was a little bit brighter, but you basically wanna put this entire setup in the shade and that's fortunately what we've done. Now, what I'm using here, I've got a silver reflector below, which I'm gonna be picking up to kind of bounce some light into her face uh, to give me a nice even exposure. I've got a uh, roller table. This is a posing table from uh, Photogenic, I believe. I'll put that in the description. And this is holding the reflector for me so I can kind of modify that. Behind her, I have a, a Savage collapsible backdrop and it's being held by a C-stand and so, uh, it's going to move around, which is totally okay. You know, I've got it kind of held down with some sandbags. And that's our basic setup. Now, for the camera, I'm going to be shooting these at an F8. My ISO might fluctuate just depending on how dark it is because we are working with available light. Um, my shutter speed is going to be somewhere between 1 200th of a second and 1 400th of a second. And as it changes as I shoot, I'll note that on the actual photograph on the screen. So with that being said, let's go ahead and let's start shooting. All right, so there you have it, folks. Uh, really easy setup to shoot studio-looking portraits outdoors. Um, again, I'm shooting with these, shooting these shots, sorry, with the A7R III. So it doesn't matter what camera, what lens setup it is that you have. I'm just showing you guys what I'm using today. Um, however, whatever camera it is that you guys have, get out there and start shooting these portraits. It's a lot of fun. Um, make sure that while you're here, you subscribe to Adorama TV. They have a lot of great videos to watch. And also check out the Adorama Learning Center for more great content. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching The Breakdown, and I will see you in the next video. Bye, everybody. Bye-bye. Let's wait for that silly plane to go by. I'll start as soon as he's far. Come on, come on, come on. I feel the drops. Rain delays. All right, here we go. I can't believe it started raining on us. That's just crazy. I know, I said it and then it started. Oh, geez.